Been stuck in the murky weather for days now, going all the way back to last Friday. So if you add it all up, it's four or five days of just this uh, blustery, raw, cold weather, or cooler than average weather at the very least over the past several days. Now uh, we're going to have at least one more day of this kind of weather before we see some improvement heading uh, toward the weekend. But here's time lapse from last evening. We look down uh, Battle Road and in the distance there's Highway 52. That's our Lewis Donato camera. Low clouds. Occasional flurries, a couple of sprinkles yesterday, and now we're going to see more of the same again today. Here's a live look outside now down South Broadway. A gray sky overhead. We've had some starlight at times. It was kind of nice to see that a couple of hours ago. The clouds, though, will be the rule, though, for today. And we've had some snow showers and flurries. The bulk of that now drifting into the central and southern Wisconsin. Wisconsin Rapids down to the Dells, Madison area, looking at a couple of snow showers and flurries for us. A couple of flurries rotating in the back side of that storm system that's centered well north of us in the western reaches of Lake Superior at this point. Point. Gray sky overhead as it looks southward now live again from the studio on Signal Hill, Northwest Rochester. It's 30 degrees here on the weather patio. Winds have dropped off nicely from where they were yesterday. At times we had gusts to around 30 miles per hour. It won't be quite as breezy today, but still there will be a breeze that will develop. 20, 25 mile per hour winds will be common from late morning into the afternoon. That's going to keep that wind chill level in the 20s to low 30s. Right now it feels like 23. Air pressure is slightly higher and slowly rising right now as the storm system begins to slowly pull away. 29 right now at the Rochester International Airport, Dodge Center 28. It's 30 in Mason City and 32 right now in Rushford. Again, here in the Med City, 30, uh, 29, just shy of 30. It feels like 18 right now. The winds have been uh, diminishing, but still a bit of a wind chill impact out there. Definitely a cold, raw morning. Snow showers and flurries. We see those uh, ro rotating in. The back side of that storm system, little energy, little trough here swinging through. That's enhancing some of the lift, producing some of those extra clouds, the showers, and eventually as it pulls away more of those gusty west and northwest winds throughout the day. And we'll see some of that activity showing up in high res future track, the computer model this morning. This is the short term one day model. We look ahead at these little bursts of flurry and snow shower activity, no accumulation, but we saw flakes yesterday. We'll see them again this morning as we warm up into the 40s, something we failed to, to do yesterday. 37 was the high, incidentally, only uh, with wind chill. I think the warmest wind chill we had was 29 yesterday. Uh, maybe a little better today, but sprinkles rotating in the backs of that system. Spotty rain showers all the way until about 9, maybe 10 o'clock tonight before we finally then see a drier pattern sh uh, shaping up and setting in behind that system. A 29 in Rochester now, Des Moines 35. 20 is pretty common across the plains. Miles City 24, uh, 28 in Fargo and Minot 22. Gray skies with uh, raw winds and uh, spotty showers today. Not as uh, breezy and a little sunnier and drier for the next couple of days. The weekend looks a little uh, warmer yet with a, a shot at the mid 50s even. Sounds awfully nice compared to the 30s and 40s we've had for highs recently. 30 degrees, a few flurries for that morning commute. Northwest winds around 8 miles per hour. Those winds pick up again 15 to 20, uh, at times 23 miles per hour or so. 42 by uh, 3 o'clock overall high temperature today. Around 44 is still about uh, 13 degrees shy of the climate average. Dropping back to the 30s overnight tonight. Not quite the 20s we had last night or even this morning. Wind chill in the 30s uh, through much of the day to around 40, which is definitely better than the 20s we had all day yesterday. There's a departing storm system, clouds wrapping around, some raw winds and some spotty showers. Breaks in the clouds late tonight at times. And then tomorrow, occasional sun and clouds, especially for the afternoon. A little more sunshine, a little less wind. Daytime highs tomorrow, still shy of 50, just shy of that. And then we'll be a little warmer yet on Friday. Extra sun, less wind. Looking at highs in the mid-50s, almost too good to be true. Supper we've not been in a while. 54 by Friday, weekend looking seasonably cool with 50s for the most part and a dry stretch of weather uh, for the weekend. Rain and snow showers today. Raw winds out of the northwest. 44 in Rochester, 46 Mesa City and 45 in Grand Meadow with uh, winds at times 25 miles per hour. Uh, tonight, 34. A couple of evening sprinkles, a diminishing northwest breeze. Seven day forecast. A little sun tomorrow, especially in the afternoon. Friday looking bright and pleasant. Weekend looking pretty decent for the most part. And then just a few light showers next Monday. But again, the weekend looking at least a little better than the past four or five days have been for us. Improvement is coming. Thanks.